want to show you the difference between a would you recommend us page and a feedback page. So what you're looking at obviously is the would you recommend us page. If you select yes, you have one of two options. It can go to a page like this where an individual can have directories of their choice. So they can leave a Google review or a Facebook review or a Yelp review. Or the second option is you select one directory like Google and we set it up to where when an individual clicks yes, it goes straight to the Google Naked link so that the rate us and review us box shows up. Um, okay, so that's the would you recommend us page. For the um, feedback page, what this does is this collects information and so it's takes the first name, or full name, I'm sorry, email address, um, your rating, and then it says, you know, be more specific and describe your experience with us. Empire Industries. Company that helps <clears throat> with their properties. <laughs> Not very 2W ish, but I <laughs> just want to give you an example. I know your time is short. Anyways, so then from here, um, not only can they select where they want their review to go, whether it's Google, Yelp, or Yellow Pages, it also allows them to authorize you to post the testimonial anywhere online. So this could be something that you can, you know, you receive confirmation to go and put on the website or to, you know, blast all over the social media sites that you need to. <laughs> then it says, I verify I have done business with this company and my testimonial is accurate and true. Um, I verify that I was not paid to leave this review and I verify that I have read and agreed to the terms of service. By clicking submit, I agree these terms of service. And then once you go to the next step, it takes you to a thank you feedback page. Hi, and thank you for leaving and um, shows your review. So if you have any questions, uh, let me know. <laughs>